Welcome to our midweek catch up. We just finished our time of prayer together and the Lord really ministered to us and spoke to us um, and gave us a prophetic word for this morning, uh, which we're thankful for. So I had a client early in the morning and um, her husband dropped at the gym, it was around half past six, and uh, she said to me, he just went off to go and surf. And I was quite shocked because it was quite cold that morning. And I said to her, first of all, it's really cold. And second of all, it's winter. Why is he surfing in the season? And she said to me, well, first of all, he's got a wetsuit, so he'll be warm in the water. And the second part was winter is the best part, best time to surf, because the swell is bigger and the waves are bigger. So the surfers enjoy it more, because it propels them better into the directions that they want to go into. And that really spoke to me um, about the Holy Spirit and how the Holy Spirit propels us and moves us in different seasons. But the big point that hit me was that the waters are rising. And that takes me to Habakkuk 2 verse 14 where it says, For the earth will be filled with the knowledge of the glory of the Lord as the waters cover the sea. So I'll break that scripture up just for a second there. The earth will be filled, or the earth is filled with the knowledge. And that knowledge to me speaks about an awareness of God's presence. God's presence is all around us. The glory of the Lord is all around us. It fills the earth. The only difference is we as His people need to become aware of His presence. And that is our prayer this day, and we prayed this morning, is that God will make us more aware of His presence as it is raining by His, pres by His Spirit, and His presence is filling the atmosphere, that we as His children will become aware of it and be able to move by His Spirit like the waves propelling a surfer. I want to give you some homework uh, this week. If you can go and read Ezekiel 47, and the one scripture that jumped out at me was verse 5 where it's, the word says again he measured off a third of a mile and now it was a river that I could not cross on foot the water had risen it was deep enough to swim in a river that could not be crossed on foot the water is rising the seasons are changing God is allowing his presence to fill the atmosphere and we as his children I pray that we will become obedient to be led by his spirit and swim and move wherever the water's currents propel us. I pray that you are encouraged. I pray that you are blessed by that. Be led by the Spirit. God is taking us to good and fertile lands. Please go and read Ezekiel 47 and give us some feedback on what you received. Bless you. We love you all. We'll see you on Sunday morning.